uh, your friend Jimbo said yesterday that um, at some point while well, you're in Tuscaloosa, he was going to beat your butt. That wasn't the word that he used, but did you have any response for that? In golf. <laughs> <laughs> And of course, a fun back and forth between Jimbo Fisher and Nick Saban this summer after Jimbo said they would beat Alabama's butt at the Houston Touchdown Club. And since it's talking season this week at SEC Media Days, Jimbo got his chance to respond. Of course, he would be the first assistant to beat Saban as St. Nick has a perfect 23 0 record against his former assistants, including a 4 0 mark against Fisher. But Jimbo did not come to AM to kiss the rings of Nick Saban. No, I don't have any regrets. That's what we're here for, isn't it? And that while we're here, and then what everybody's here, it's what makes this league this league. That's what we expect to do at Texas A&M. Nick and I are friends. We've known each other a long time, we've coached together. We're from the same world. He's the standard, and they're the standard of what you have to play to. Me sitting here saying we want to beat him doesn't beat him. We have to develop the skills, the habits, the practice habits, to get the right players in the right place, coach the heck out of them, let them play, and be able to play those games and understand how to play those games. Your opponent has nothing to do with how you play. You play to your standard. The standard is the standard.